what's up guys it's your girl dad and i'm back again with another video and today i'm gonna just be doing the cute little pink set but before we get into this video make sure you guys are subscribed to my channel i will be doing two giveaways so you don't want to miss that also if you like this video give me a thumbs up so the first thing i'm gonna do is of course prep my nails push the cuticles back go in and take the shine off the nail and since you did a color change if you kind of see it's like a little bumpy or something you could just kind of smooth it out if you want not necessary but that's what i always do if i see it looking kind of crazy after that i'm gonna go in and dust them off use swipe and then prime the nails twice i always do two coats then I'm going to go in and put a very thin layer of clear down because I'm going to be working with, like, anytime I'm doing, like, designs or I know I do frequent color changes, I always put a clear layer down just to make sure that the nails are not lifting and they're pretty much secured the way I need them to be. After that, then I go in and start putting down my new acrylic on the nail that's going to be all new with the crock print. And then on the other nails, I start with putting pink on all the nails first. Then I go back in, ombre down my nude, cap it with clear, and that's it, guys. I did include my shaping and styling on this video. Well, no, actually, I only include some shaping. I didn't include styling because I wasn't on camera good enough. But you guys know how I foul. I start at the bottom of the nail, then I go on the sides, and then I do the tip. That's how I foul every time. And I also make sure I flip my client's nail hand around so that I can get the client's view. That's it for shaping, guys. Nothing complicated. This is a pretty easy set that even someone that's a beginner starting out could do this set. For the crock print, all I did was go in with blooming gel. And once I put the plump the blooming gel down then i went in with my pink color with my dotting pen and then you know you just kind of let it spread and form the way you want and then you pop it in the lamp so if you don't want it to spread too much you want to make sure that you work pretty fast and another thing that i learned was to not work with so much so much of a thick layer of the blooming gel just go in with a nice little layer nothing where it's going to be spreading like immediately as you put it on the nail you want it to just gradually spray it <clears throat> but if you're looking for a more effect where you do want it to spread more or faster then you can use a thicker layer but that's pretty much it guys top coated it at the end and that was it a pretty cute basic set and make sure you guys do subscribe to my channel i am doing my first giveaway once i hit 500 subscribers and then i'll do be doing my second one at a thousand so you don't want to miss that you don't want to miss my daily nail videos and i will catch you guys in my next one bye
Thank <laughs> you.